guys, I finally did it. I finally made a big storage uh, storage house or what you call it, I don't know. Storage hut? No, it's not a hut. A big storage right here. With some, uh, just outside here I have some barrels, uh, wheat or yeah, hay bales, some iron over here. Uh, just make it look good. Got some wood over here. And all of this here is basically just for good sign. Often I just uh, use fish once to store some stuff for burgundy. This there is, as you can see here. Uh, but yeah, if you go in here, you see we have a lot of chests inside here. A lot. Plus we have a working area over here with all the essentials we will need to craft everything we need. Plus some extra barrels right here, right here that are empty right now actually. But we might have some stuff in them later on. Uh, I will probably expand this uh, further back sooner or later, but for now I'm just gonna leave it like that because I don't know what else to do there. Also, I have some nice lamps above here so we get some light plus light behind the chest as you can see here. Here I haven't got a chest yet uh, because I'm not gonna have chests here. I'm actually gonna have something else here which uh, is a future project, but for now I'm just gonna leave this empty. Uh, but basically, this will be a future project. I will be probably do this episode actually later this episode. So yeah, uh, that will be fun. And here we will put all the stuff in. Basically, this part we put everything in and we'll sort this out. I still haven't uh, fixed all the uh, icon sorters, so they are basically just like this now, but uh, empty, as you can see. So nothing in them yet. I'm gonna fix that soon enough. Then up here we actually have a lovely office where I can sit and uh, yeah just do my thing. And then here we have my uh, actual and chunky room. So I moved it from that building to here now. I don't have enough bookshelves yet but uh, I have been farming up cows as you can see over there while I was building it. So we will probably have enough now hopefully. So yeah let's actually go and uh, kill them all. Okay, so I also forgot to say uh, over there that I have been enchanting a bit. So I now got this sword, which is decent, not the best, go, not the best, no, but it's decent for now. I got uh, this uh, Sick Touch pickaxe, which is good. Uh, this uh, Sick Touch Efficiency 4 uh, axe, Efficiency 3 uh, sh shovel, that can actually dig normal dirt, Inska speed, like Inska my normal dirt. Uh, bow is just the same, then I got the fortune 1 efficiency 3 hoe, I don't know why I have fortune 1 on it, but I just got it when I enchanted it, so yeah, I guess gags alright. But yeah, we also got fire respect 1 on this, uh, and sleeping edge 1, so I think it's be pretty easy to kill, so let's do it. It's kind of XP farm too, not gonna lie. <laughs> okay, so there, I killed all of them but 2, just so we can bring them up again, so we got a lot of uh, leather actually, including a lot of meat, including cooked meat because we had uh, fire spec 1. But yeah, I also uh, removed all the grass blocks around here, plus uh, and added uh, some uh, moss instead. Added some leaves around here, uh, also added some more grass. And I think it looks better, it looks more uh, uh, custom in my opinion. I guess, uh, it's almost nice, I just realized. Uh, so yeah, I think it looks really nice now uh yeah time to get some sugar canes i can make paper okay so we got 15 bookshelves from that i still have a lot of leather left though the only thing i ran out was sugar canes i can get more paper and then i also got a lot of wood from the fish just down here so that's fine or barracks i mean so let's just put this out there that looks good, and uh, now Gak looks a bit weird, I think I know a way to fix that. So if you just take some spruce stairs and remove this, and that, so we don't waste anything. So on this side, because I will go up sooner or later too, Facebook jokes. And then we just do this. I suppose all we can do now is uh, expand on uh, this place, the trading hall, because I haven't done that in a while. Offer than uh, yeah, making this one higher for security reasons. But yeah, I kind of need to expand this now because I need more villagers. But yeah, uh, let's uh, do a montage.
All right, so I have done a bit. I'm obviously not done here. I have a good roof uh, to do and uh, some more walks over here and stuff like that. But after from that, I think it's done. I, I don't think I need more than this. So yeah, I, I really need more of this guys go so I can trade the iron for emeralds because it's a bit slow right now. But from that, yeah, I'm good to go. So my plan is to have a few more farmers possibly and find a few more offer trades. I found also like some stairs over here, plus some chests over here. For example, we've got Silk Touch, picture one is not that good. Uh, Fortune, Fair Fortune 3, I have Fair Fortune 3 in my books already, so I just could get ones and find a Pokemon Getter on my books. Uh, Brass Protection 4, and then here we have Protection 4 and Sweeping Edge 1. And then we also got Mending books up there, but I used all of them already. Uh, you can see here we got a lot of stuff. I also rain shock in my stuff and yeah, it's pretty good. I'm getting pretty good right now, I think. But yeah, we got stairs here, it goes up here. And I think I'm gonna remove this book because just having one here, I don't feel like that's uh, yeah, it feels like a big of a waste. But yeah, up here we got six here, uh, and I prepared four of them. Two here, I haven't uh, done anything with yet, like see here, for turn two. Efficiency for 4, like school base 10, I'm not gonna take that one. But here we got protection 4, sipping edge, uh, third volume 3, flame, best protection 4, sick touch, protection 1, fortune 3, and here is commanding. I, I always get commanding first because it's the most important one. Uh, punch 2, so I mean, this one only has many that's good with the buck. Yeah, I mean, I like him. I also uh, changed this iron a bit and terraform it a bit just to make it look better because I do have plans for that now so I'm going to prepare that off cam uh, so basically if we go over here you can see I've added the uh, trees, uh, bushes I forgot to add logs later on like I have on that side though but I mean I don't think I have space for that anymore maybe here one but yeah, uh, I get that guess and uh, it looks much better now. Over here I might have uh, some sort of dock for boats and stuff like that. And then over here I'm gonna have actually a bridge that goes over here to that spot and I, I will tie from over there and then uh, take this bridge over there. And then we we'll probably have a road go from there to there and go a cave entrance and we lead to the rescue area right there. Plus another row I will go over there to another spot which I'm not gonna show yet. But yeah, I think that's gonna be pretty good. I have guess a sort of a meeting point for first group uh, places. Cause uh, this is actually my skulker base so I can wanna keep using this for something. And a meeting point I think is the best way to go then. But yeah, yeah, I first enderman around here just taking grass everywhere. And then again, kind of box. It's really annoying to go around and remove them. But I can't really do anything about that now, uh, up here, yes. Anything else? And uh, no, not that I can see. But yeah, now we're actually gonna go over here to this spot. I still haven't fixed the storage system, uh, but uh, that will be fixed uh, eventually. But now we actually use this spot for a mob farm. That was my plan all along. Because I really do need to get uh, bones. Uh, I, was gonna, I can also get gunpowder from that uh, mob farm. Which means that we can actually cover the gunpowder farm also because it will produce gunpowder. Let's make the mob farm so let's uh, yeah jump to time lapse. All right, so it's uh, done. Uh, I got some uh, tinted glass. Yeah, tinted glass right here. And then I got the farm up there. The mob farm, I guess, the spawn platforms. And then down here is the killing area, which they get killed by magma blocks. The loot goes straight up here. Fish chest. I've been AFK for a few hours now. I don't have a good AFK spot yet, it's really slow, but yeah, it's been like two or three hours, and I don't have much. It's some still, so I hope we can keep producing while I'm working off of stuff. But I'm going to make a proper AFK area up there soon enough. Which I don't want to do until I'm a Lycra. Because I'm going to probably make it a 
some so sort of uh, balloon ship or something like that. I think this guy wants to kill me. Well, too bad I'm too good for you. <laughs> but anyways, uh, yeah, uh, please like and subscribe and comment. I will see you next time. See ya.